This is Taryn Jarvis, garden coordinator at Rare, coming to you live from the Springbank Food Bank Gardens at Rare Charitable Research Reserve. Earlier this year, we partnered with Preston Idea Exchange, Cambridge Self-Help Food Bank, and Seeds of Diversity Canada to come up with this fabulous project called One Seed, One Community. We've been sharing provider bean seeds all around our community with the hopes that people will join together and grow this bean for themselves and their families. Now, we were scheduled to have a grand planting event next week. And due to current circumstances, here I am alone in the garden, but I really wanna share with you the joy of planting these beans. It's easy, it's fun, and it pro pro produces a lot of food. So what we're gonna do is have a nice, nicely weeded garden area, loose soil. My friend Matt got here ahead of me and pulled out these weeds, so I'd like to thank him very much for that. Teamwork makes the dream work, it's true. So we will dig a little trench here. And with your beans, pop one bead in the soil. Give it a next bean about 10 centimeters away or a hand width. Another 10 centimeters away or a hand width until you have all the beans in the soil. And then we will lightly cover those beans up with the loose soil and give them a water. Saturate them well when you plant them. And then if necessary, water them again when the soil dries out. You can expect these beans to sprout in just a couple days, two or three days. The plants themselves will begin to produce edible beans in approximately seven weeks. And this is the type of bean plant. It's, it's a bush bean, it's not a trellised bean, so you have no, no need for structural work in your garden. And the more beans you pick off the plant, the more beans that this plant will produce. So I do hope that you will grow your provider beans at home and tell us all about your experience. A few weeks ago when you joined me here in the greenhouse, we planted these beans together and look at them now. I just wanted to remind everyone that if you don't have garden space at home, you can still have a beautiful bean plant. All you need is a pot and some loose soil. Just make sure your pot's deep enough, approximately 25 centimeters, and wide enough, approximately 20 centimeters across the top. In just a few more short weeks, this pot will be full of beautiful provider beans. On behalf of the Cambridge Self-Help Food Bank, Idea Exchange Preston, Seeds of Diversity, and the Rare Charitable Research Reserve, I would like to thank you for participating in our One Seed, One Community extravaganza.